mission on Twitch would be to bring more people my age and more young black kids my age to start streaming on Twitch more. I want to be a YouTuber because you can do everything you want to do. You can be whoever you want. You can do, be creative in your own way. I want to be a creator because I've got a lot of inspiration from other YouTubers and streamers and stuff. And I want to just be just more successful than them actually more successful. You know, I help my parents out mostly. I love to create like streams and YouTube videos and I like to make people laugh. My market will be people my age and like people that like gaming just as much as I do. Playing football and basketball at the park mainly. And I love sneakers like Jordans and Nikes. And I, I like to, I love cleaning my shoes. Baking, because that's fun. Because like you can be decorative. I like to dance, I like to do TikTok. Playing Madden. I sometimes play Call of Duty. GTA too, GTA is really fun. School, which I really want to go to. And the drama is just, it's just tea. I just like to watch it because it's fun. Sometimes, not really sports, but a little bit of sports. Like most of the time I have to record and then edit, which is the worst part. My mom looked at it, but she's not gonna edit my videos. Cause she had this stuff to do. I did have to deck my friends today because I didn't want to play with them. I mean, I not want to play with them, but I was streaming so I couldn't text, text or talk to them or play with them like Noah. Mm -hmm. You want me to play with him when I was, I was doing something else. I really want to go to school because those reasons. The only thing I'm not really excited about that is because I don't want to eat their food. Like my mama food and my food instead. Because she don't cook really much. I cook, me, TJ. And uh, she's usually editing or doing homework. She never has time for us anymore. I was always creative as a child. I tried drawing, I was terrible at it. And me and my cousin, we always try to make music. I would say the funniest person. The funniest I know is Nicole. He's the funniest out of all of us. He just makes like the the craziest jokes that are like just the funniest. Um he funny. The one thing my mom wants me to understand about this world is that men can make excuses. One thing that my mother taught me to not say is oh, dang. um Excuses, no excuses, no excuses, or she's just gonna annoy you. <laughs> of, <laughs> of course, I said chores, um, because living in a black household, it's just you have to do something around the house, you can just lay around like a little lazy rat all day. You gotta clean up something, you gotta be useful. I mow the lawn, I wash the dishes, and I take out the trash. And I don't get paid. My motivation comes from my parents and Kai next door. And it's not hard, but it's pretty hard. You just get like, put some work into it. I want to get more donations and followers. The most talented person in my uh, crew is my mom. Because like you can multitask like really good, even though I can't because like I just focus to one thing and then go to another thing. And I do sometimes like when she's a director, but then sometimes I don't. I do like her cooking. Oh yeah, my mom, my mommy. My mama do my graphics. And she do makeup too, which that's why that's why I'm in makeup because she taught me. The most talented person in my family, I would say, is my dad because he's an audio engineer. He is a great father. He is a project manager at work and he can work on cars, pumps, I mean fuel pumps, anything, like anything that has an engine or. He's good at sports too, but really good at sports. Oh, he's good at gaming too, just as me, but he, I don't think he, well, he says he's better than me, but I don't think he's better than me. Maybe at one game, but that's it. Actually, two games. He's better than me at 2K. I'm not good at 2K. What I learned most about TikTok is fake and fraud and there's like weird hacks that are not even true. There's weird people on there. It's not all real. 
What I learned most about being a creator is it's harder than it looks. Like watching the YouTube videos and strip Twitch streams, it's not that easy. It's a lot of steps, especially in like OBS and my platform that I'm using. It's way harder. Like sometimes something not functions, I have to delete it and restart it completely. And it just takes too long. Some advice I would give a creator that's my age is to stay consistent and don't give up like because as soon as you give up or you don't stay if you don't stay consistent it's gonna fall it's gonna go downhill if i have to give advice to a kid my age stay creative um stick with your imagination um be you be who you are reach for your goals like reach for your dreams Live your dream. In one year, the things I see for my channel is sponsorships, brand deals, and collaboration with other people. Many, many other people. In one year, I'll probably say like maybe 800 still going up, higher, higher. Maybe like at the end, probably like maybe like 20 mil, somewhere near there. So the stuff you're gonna be looking forward to is basketball videos, track videos, hair videos, makeup videos, and videos. My name is Siraji Nail and I'm a creator. My name is TJ and I'm a creator.